Mass and weight. Mass is measured using the platform balance. The volume of a liquid or an irregularly shaped solid is measured by using the graduated cylinder. The volume of a regular solid is measured by measuring its length, width, and height with a ruler. Let us discuss more about mass, weight, and volume of objects. How is mass different from weight? How do you measure volume of solids and liquids? What units of measurements are used? Weight Weight is the pull of gravity on matter. If you drop a book, it will fall to the floor. Why? The book falls toward the floor because Earth pulls all objects toward it. When you weigh an object, you are really measuring the pull of gravity on that object. Gravity controls the weight of an object. As you get closer to the center of Earth, the pull of gravity gets stronger, so you weigh more. As you move away from the center of Earth, the pull of gravity gets weaker, so you weigh less. You would weigh slightly less on top of a high mountain than you would on a plane. Gravity is the force that pulls all objects toward the center of Earth. When you go to a market, you see all kinds of fruits and vegetables, fish, meat, and rice. The vendors weigh them before they are sold. The vendors use the weighing scale to get their weight. The word weight is sometimes interchanged with the word mass because they are related. The mass of an object is reflected by its weight. The more mass an object has, the greater its weight. What is the difference between weight and mass? Mass refers to the amount of matter an object contains. It is not affected by gravity. Since the pull of gravity affects weight, weight can change. However, the mass of an object always stays the same. The pull of gravity on Earth, the Moon, and Jupiter are different from each other because they are not of the same size. Therefore, the weight of an object will be different on Earth, the Moon, and Jupiter, but the mass of the same object will not change. Analyze the chart and give your own explanation on the difference between mass and weight. An object that has a mass of 6 kg on Earth will still have 6 kg mass whether it is on the Moon or on planet Jupiter. The weight of the same object becomes less when it is transferred from Earth to the Moon. But in Jupiter, the weight of the object is greater. It is because the Moon's gravity is lesser than Jupiter's gravity. A balance is used to measure the mass of objects. The units of mass are grams and kilograms. We are using the metric measurement. Can you measure the mass of five marbles using the balance? What is the mass? If you crush the five marbles and measure the mass, will you get the same mass as that of the five whole marbles? Why? Volume Matter takes up space. Therefore, it has volume. This means that it has length, width, and height. We can get the volume of a regular object, like a block of wood, by multiplying its length, width, and height. Volume is expressed in units called cubic centimeter and cubic meter. 
If a rectangular block measures 4 cm in length, 4 cm in width, and 2 cm in thickness, what is the volume? Formula. Volume equals length times width times height. Volume equals length 4 cm times width 4 cm times height 2 cm. The volume of the rectangular block is 32 cubic centimeters. To determine the volume of liquids, use the laboratory equipment called the graduated cylinder. If you pour the liquid into the graduated cylinder, the number you see that coincides with the uppermost level of liquid is its volume. The unit of volume for liquids is an ml or a milliliter. In measuring the volume of irregularly shaped solids, you use the water displacement method. How do you do this? Try to do this short and simple activity. Measure a definite volume of water in the graduated cylinder. Then carefully drop a small stone into the graduated cylinder. You will surely observe that the volume of water will rise. What is the level of water now? What is the original volume of water? To get the volume of the stone, subtract the initial amount of water from the water level after the stone was dropped. If the original volume of water is 60 ml and the final volume is 83 ml, after you added the stone into the graduated cylinder, what is the volume? The volume of the stone is the final volume less its original volume or 83 ml minus 60 ml equals 23 ml. Observing properties of matter. Look closely at the two materials described in the activity. Find out the relationship of the mass of the objects with the kind of material they are made of. Observing the properties of two different materials. Problem. What did you observe about the mass of the two objects of the same size, shape, and form? What to do? 1. Prepare the materials. 2. Observe the physical properties of the two boxes. 3. Measure the mass and volume of the two boxes. 4. Record your observations. Do the two boxes have the same mass? Do they have the same volume? Why? What is the relationship of the mass of the objects with the kind of material they are made of? Some objects having the same size, shape, and form have more mass than others. The mass of objects depends on the kind of materials they are made of.